I've always been obsessed with making food, like fake food. This is a resin margarita. Hey, Ma! For this project, you're going to need resin, a fancy glass, whatever you're using to color the resin, pigment, sparkles, white sand, and any optional accessories you want. Here you see me mixing the hardener for the resin into the actual resin, making sure I get all of that resin out. It's kind of thick, but you have to be precise with your measurements. Um, then I'm going to mix it together really slow so that I don't get too many bubbles and very thoroughly. It's going to look kind of swirly once the swirls go away and it's not like kind of opaque anymore that and when it clears up again you'll know it's ready. Uh, it looks like I'm mixing this really fast but I'm actually mixing it very slow. Uh, <laughs> it took about five minutes to mix it very slowly because I want it to have control over the bubbles. So um, once it's done mixing, um, the first thing I wanted to do was to put the rim on the glass because I figured that would be very hard to put on later on. So I took the tongue depressor I was using and again very slowly I went around, um, don't let the video mislead you, I went very slow, I didn't want to have any drips or anything like that. So you see me holding it upside down, just I went a little thick in an area. But um, you want to go all the way around, try to get it done in the first pass, uh, and then I'm rolling it, that's uh, white sand, you can't really see it because it's on a piece of white paper, but it's white sand that has a little bit of uh, sparkle to it. And I picked that up from Dollar Tree. Salted rim, check. Okay, so once that's done, I take the rest of the resin and I add the like this white pearlesque kind of colorant. Um, that gives it a little bit of a shimmer and it makes it a little bit more opaque. I then mix that with like about two drops of yellow acrylic. Just go really slow adding whatever type of colorant you're using because you're going for that perfect margarita kind of... I was going for the, the real actual yellow kind of tequila color. You might want to go for the fake green mixer color, but I wanted to go all tequila with this one. I think that's pretty good. I added sparkles and in retrospect I probably would add like smaller sparkles than these. These were kind of large, but I still like the effect. I, it just really puts that kind of like maybe it's nice look to it. So here goes. We're pouring it. Look at that. That just looks so good. Perfect. So Okay, so here's a fault of mine that I always do with resin. You're supposed to first put water in the container to make sure you mix up the right amount of resin. I did not, um, and I suffered because of it. So okay, I added the hardener again, I added the resin again, and here I'm mixing again. In reality though, I was mixing very, very, very slowly. Um, that first batch didn't even cover the bottom part of the glass. To make lemons out of lemonade, um, I decided to go for an ombre effect. So here I just added a little bit more yellow to the to the new mixture and I didn't add more sparkles. Um, I'm not drinking that. Well, maybe I, I, maybe I was being driven to drink, but I realized it wasn't real. Okay, that still wasn't enough. So um, I'm mixing again. I'm mixing again. So yeah, just take that extra step in the beginning. I didn't want to wet the glass, but measure how much you're going to need so you can get it done at once. Okay, so just take it for granted. I finally got it to the right height. Okay, um, here's the leaves that I had from some fake flower. I'm trying to cut it down, um, make it not look like mint because I might do a mimosa later, but um, just something that looks like a realistic garnish. Let's just move on. Staging is all important. Here's a lime from my yard. Um, actually, no. The limes aren't ready, 
So uh, this is a premature lemon. And here's the final result. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit the like button. And if you like the videos that we are doing, then go ahead and make my mother happy and subscribe. Happy Margarita Day.